Just in the same way as you don't focus your attention on how you make your thyroid gland function. So in the same way you don't have any attention focused on how you shine the sun. So then, let me connect this with the problem of birth and death, which puzzles people enormously, of course. Because in order to understand what, what the self is, shut the water when you're brushing your teeth, you have to remember that it doesn't need to remember anything. Just like you don't need to know how you work your thyroid gland. So then, when you die, you're not going to have to put up with everlasting non-existence because that's not an experience. Uh, I like to save electricity by turning the lights off. A lot of people are afraid that when they die, they're going to be locked up in a dark room forever. Unplug your toaster. And, it, and sort of undergo that. How do I save electricity? One of the most interesting things in the world, this is a yoga, this is a way of realization. Try and imagine what it will be like to go to sleep and never wake up. You know, you save electricity by showering with cold water. You know, personally, I haven't done that, but it's never too late to start. What will it be like to go to sleep and never wake up? No lo sé, que es con secador. Secalo al natural. And if you think long enough about that, something will happen to you. Personally, I have to save energy by taking naps. Um, I feel it helps conserve energy for myself and helps the environment. You will find out, among other things, I don't watch TV, that uh, it'll pose the next question to you. What was it like to wake up after having never gone to sleep? That was when you were born. If you leave your room, just of the light, because it just takes a second. You see, you, you can't have an experience of nothing. Nature abhors a vacuum. So after you're dead, the only thing that can happen is the same experience or the same sort of experience as when you were born. In other words, we all know very well that after people die, other people are born. And they're all you. Only you can only experience it one at a time. Isn't it? Doesn't it really astonish you that you are this fantastically complex thing? You don't have to know how to shine the sun. You just do it. This water tastes weird. You never learned to procure this miracle? Well, the point is that from a strictly physical scientific standpoint this organism is a continuous energy with everything else that's going on and if i am my foot i am the sun i don't save electricity